Hello, welcome back to another episode on Sam's YouTube channel. Last week, I went 8-8 eight and eight last week. Not a good prediction for me. Let's see if we do better this week. Miami and Cincinnati. Miami being Buffalo last week. So, they're 3-0. They're the Cincinnati Bengals stay in their first win of the year. So, hopefully they'll hit some momentum into that first win at home. But I think the Dolphins will win, improving to 4-0. Vikings and Saints, the Saints being played in London. The Vikings being the Lions, not very impressive. And then the Saints losing again to the Saints losing to the Panthers. So I think I think the Vikings will win this game in London. And they'll improve the three and one and atop the NFC North. Browns and Falcons, the Browns being Pittsburgh last week at home on Thursday Night Football. And then the Falcons, they, they lost. So, I have the Browns winning this game. I think Nick Chubb will run all over that Falcons defense. And, yeah, I think they the W. Cowboys and Commanders, Cowboys, you know... That um, their quarterback is looking really well, looking, looking good right now. So we'll see if he will still be able to continue that stretch. I mean, they play Washington, so it's a divisional game. So I'm sure it'll be very competitive. But you gotta remember that the, the Commanders have Carson Wentz, so it won't be that surprising. I have the Dallas Cowboys winning, and they'll improve to 3-1, and one. and then I think that's coming back next week, so we'll, we'll see how that works out. Lions and Seahawks, I mean, this game is going to be such a barn burner. Um, I can't believe it's not Sunday night. Um, The Lions... You know, doing lion like things in the fourth quarter, tilting away 10 point leads. So they lost to the Vikings. Then the Seahawks, you know, they're not doing so well either. But I'm going to pit the Lions here at home. I think they'll win. The Colts and the Titans. The Colts beating the Chiefs to their first win. The Titans. Losing, so, there'll be, so, yeah, the Colts are at home, so I think the Colts will, the Colts will win, yeah. Bears and Giants, I, th I have the Bears winning, you know, we might be out with Montgomery and another key, another couple key pieces. The Giants, you know, Saquon Barkley will be a problem. But I think the Bears' defense will be able to hold them. A. Jackson will play well, I think. So I have the Bears winning. Eagles and Jaguars, I have the Eagles winning this game. The Eagles are looking on fire right now. Jalen Hurts is looking on an MVP candidate. And the Jaguars, you know... They beat they beat the Chargers last week, but Justin Herbert was hurt. Keenan Allen was out. They had a couple key pieces out. I don't think that'll be like this for the Eagles. I think they'll win and prove to four and zero. So Steelers and Jets. The Jets might get Zach Wilson back. So that that'll be good for them. The Steelers. Losing to the Browns on the road. 
But they come home against the Jets, and I think they'll take care of business. The Ravens and the Bills, I think their game should be a 325 or 720 game. But the Bills losing a heartbreaker to the Dolphins. They're going against MVP candidate Lamar Jackson. The Ravens offense, you know, they're 2 and 1. But, I mean, their offense is looking really good right now. I mean, I think when they let J.K. Dobbins back, that run game will be explosive again. But I'm actually going to take the Ravens here at home. You know, I think that defense might make Josh Allen a little uncomfortable, and the Ravens might get the win. Chargers and Texans. The Chargers, another a blowout loss at home to the Jads. And then the Texans. Less to the Bears, you know. I'm going to take the Chargers here on the road. I think Herbert's going to be fully healthy. Keenan Allen will be back. You know, Joey Bosa's on IR, so that's not good. But I have the Chargers winning. Cardinals and Panthers. The Cardinals, Kyler Murray's an electorate out there. I mean, they are 1 and 2, but I mean, Hollywood Brown's playing good right now. Then the Panthers, you know, Baker Mayfield, you know, is not not living up to the hype right now. But I'm going to take the Cardinals at home. I mean, on the road, excuse me. And then the Packers and Patriots. Patriots are without Matt Jones for a couple weeks, so it'll be Brian Hoyer. The Packers, you know, that run name is explosive, and I think that would... Get the job done, and I think Green Bay okay on um, the W. Raiders and Broncos. Raiders zero and three. You know it's a, that's surprising some people. The Broncos they won eleven to ten. That's the Forty Niners. So, but I think the Raiders will win this game. I think Derek Carr will have a game. So we'll see. Chiefs and Chiefs in Tampa for for uh, Sunday Night Football. I think this game will be really good. Both 2-1 and one teams. The Chiefs, you know, Mahomes, Kelsey, you know, Clyde Edwards Alera in the football. Tampa, you know, hopefully they're not healthy. I mean, they'll let Mike Evans back from that suspension that he had from the Saints for Pushing Lamar more that now I'm suspended one game. But I, I'm going to take the Chiefs on the road. And then for Monday Night Football, I have the Rams and the Niners. The, Ra the Rams, you know, have looked shaky as of late. You know, I know they're 2-1, but they haven't really been back to that Super Bowl cal caliber team. The Niners... Not looking good. I'm gonna take the Rams on the road this this time, this game. So I have a lot of road teams winning, but I also have a lot of home teams winning. But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. I know this video is not one of the best. It was shaky. I had to do it a second time because my fucking dog. Was being annoying. So. Yeah. Let me know. Video quality will be better. I won't trip over and stutter. As I do most times. But. Yeah. Let me know what you think down in the predictions. And. Yeah. Peace. Go Bears.